Mary Frances Hill was born in Baker County, Georgia on August 15, 1900. She was born a twin, but sadly her twin sister Martha passed away during childbirth. Mary was raised by aunts and uncles after her parents passed away at a young age. Mary barely had an education and what made it even harder for her to get one was the fact that she was a woman, but not just a woman, but a black woman living in the state of Georgia. Mary later became an influential advocate for the community of health. Mary got married to a carpenter named Ashley Coley. Mary and her family moved to Alabama, Alabama in 1930, and shortly after moving, she became interested in midwifery and was trained by Oni Lee Logan. Fun fact, Mary Frances Hill Coley delivered more than 3,000 babies in the counties of Alabama during that time. Another fun fact, after Mary would deliver the babies, she would still come back and help cook and clean to make it easier on the mom. Mary had many achievements. She was recognized in 1952 after George Stone filmed All My Babies. Stone filmed Mary for months, recording how she prepares for the delivery of each baby in a rural condition in Alabama area. In 2005, the Smithsonian Museum of African American History and Culture hosted Reclaiming Midwives, Pillars of Community Support, which featured Mary and a few other midwives. That same year, Mary was also featured in Columbia University School of Nursing and well at, as well as Mailman School of Public Health in New York City. In 1966, Mary passed away in Alabama. She was recognized at many things for many things, but was mainly recognized for being a, being a healer and a huge advocate for healthy babies, and that was always her main goal. Black girl magic, I got black girl magic in my head.